A new direct and first flight service between Cape Town and Sao Paulo in Brazil has been launched. The new route is expected to help strengthen economic ties between the Western Cape and Brazil and also open up immense opportunities for enhanced trade, tourism and investment. For more on this now, we're joined by the Western Cape Finance and Economic Opportunities MEC, Mireille Wenger, who joins us all the way from beautiful and wet Cape Town. MEC, thanks for your time this evening. Uh, direct flights between Cape Town and Sao Paulo uh, are quite fitting because one always hears people um, compare um, Rio and Cape Town. Uh, what kind of impact will this kind of um, flight route have on the Western Cape? Yeah, well, we're absolutely delighted at the news that SAA will be flying uh, direct from Cape Town to Sao Paulo. Uh, just before the pandemic, we saw that uh, Latin America was one of our fastest growing uh, markets in percentage terms. Um, and so uh, the Air Access team housed within Westgrow, which is our trade investment and tur tourism promotion agency, has been working very hard behind the scenes with the airlines and the airports. And uh, today the announcement was finally, ama uh, finally made. Uh, and so that means um, more tourists uh, coming from South America into the Western Cape and South Africa. And of course, more tourists mean more jobs. And in addition, it will also help uh, boost cargo flows between the two countries, mm. which uh, contributes to trade uh, between South Africa and Brazil. Yeah, I mean, that is a, a very big part of, of your portfolio. It's finance and economic opportunities. Now, Brazil, of course, is BRICS mates with South Africa. Um, how are you hoping that this uh, route will enhance um, the relationship between uh, this region of South Africa and indeed their BRICS partner, Brazil? Yes. So it was one of our most underserved markets because there were no flights into South America at all uh, at the present. So uh, it was certainly something that needed to happen. Uh, and now we can finally say that it is here and that uh, bookings open tonight. Uh, flights will start flying from the end of October out of Cape Town. Um, and uh, it, it will also have an uh, important uh, time saver for business travelers. Currently, because you can't fly direct, uh, it takes much longer. Um, and this eight hour flight will now shave about 50% off um, current travel time. So much more efficient. And of course, directly into Sao Paulo, which is um, Brazil's financial hub um, and um, you know, one of the leading cities uh, within the country. Um, now, it doesn't seem you can't open your browser, your news browsers every day without reading a story about more airlines interested in putting on more flights to South Africa. That must be good news to you. Just a few days ago, there was news saying that Cathay Pacific and Ethiopian Airlines wanting to dramatically increase their number of weekly flights and, and looking at um, uh, routes via Durban and Cape Town. This must be massive news for you. And, and, and what kind of interaction is there with these major airlines to in, try and encourage this kind of of, of growth absolutely so in the last year we've uh, seen many uh, new flights into cape town starting with uh, flights to the united states we now have direct flights into washington new york and atlanta so we have 13 direct flights per week out of cape town and we've just seen how the number of american tourists has just skyrocketed and we're very happy to welcome more and more american tourists uh, to our shores uh, then uh, more recently, we've also announced uh, flights from Cape Town to Eswatini, to Lusaka, to Maputo, and also to uh, Brussels. So uh, we're absolutely delighted because this increased air connectivity gives travelers from around the world more options to come and visit South Africa. And as mentioned, more tourists mean more jobs mm. for South Africans. Now, I flew in and out of Cape Town just a few weeks ago, and that airport just always seems to be busy. It doesn't matter what time of day you're coming in and out of there. Um, is there moves afoot to try and look at a possible expansion of the airport, or are we um, counting our chickens far too soon? Well, uh, from the Western Cape government side, we're working very hard to grow tourism. Uh, we'd like to uh, certainly see the number of tourists increase uh, into our destination. And of course, the airport is a key partner in that. We work very well uh, with Cape Town International Airport, which uh, for seven years in a row has been voted Africa's best uh, airport. Um, we do understand from AXA that there are plans to expand Cape Town International Airport. But of course, what we'd like to see is uh, that expansion happen sooner rather than in the medium mm. term. 
Okay, we're going to leave it there. You heard it here first, Cape Town Airport. Uh, the ball is in your court. That's the MEC for Finance and Economic Opportunities in the Western Cape. Mireille Wenger joining us virtually from there in Cape Town.